to oh, move here. Another week. Gonna... I'm not ready, guys. At all. Isn't that I'm not ready for the, the cold weather at all. It's I not, know. It's, not, it's nice when it's 40s in the morning and then it's warm up. It's later. ideal. I mean, yeah. really a top 10 day, right? I mean, at 41, but if you forget your jacket, you run out to the car, it's like, you'll be, okay. be yeah. fine. You'll be fine. What you need the jacket is if you're spending, like, a, you know, a little bit of time outside, taking the dog for a walk. If uh, you're going for a walk this morning yourself or sitting out on the deck or porch, yeah, you need the light jacket, but really fantastic stuff. I mean, if you're heading down to the Big E, you might need it 8, 9 o'clock this morning. You're not going to need it by noontime, though. With sunshine prevailing, temperatures will warm up. And like yesterday, very similar to yesterday, wall-to-wall -wall sunshine, temps in the high to low, uh, low to mid 70s, I sh should say, and not much wind. The wind will be on the light side as well. Perfect day if you're heading down to the Big E or any outdoor activities that, that you have. The kids have games after school this evening. It should be fine for that as well. Now, once the sun starts to go down, we'll cool off pretty quickly. And again tonight, we're going to be back down into the 40s. Uh, for overnight lows. We'll start to notice some thin clouds early tomorrow, and eventually those clouds are going to win out. But we're going to squeeze in another nice day tomorrow. But today, perfect, just like yesterday. Tomorrow, some high and mid level clouds, but we're staying dry all day long into tomorrow night. It's on Saturday and over the weekend that it's cloudy, cool, and breezy. We know that much, and we know we're going to get some rain. The question is how much. It does look like at least periods of light rain Saturday, and most likely it's probably going to be the case on Sunday as well as the low pressure heads our way. Temperature 41, coolest spot. Pretty much in southern New England, right here in the valley with a clear sky, no wind. That cool air likes to pool in the lowest levels, hence the valleys end up being cool. cool. But we warm up quickly and temperatures catch up in the valley with readings coming up into the low to mid 70s this afternoon. High pressure is in charge. We like that. Too bad, though, high pressure isn't going to stay in charge over the weekend. This is the moisture that's going to be heading our way as we head into the weekend. Now, tomorrow, we're going to notice the high and mid-level clouds that the sun should have no problem shining through most of the day. By the evening, as the sun goes down, we will go overcast. We're dry tomorrow night. We're probably starting dry on Saturday in the morning, but we're kind of on borrowed time. During the morning, this rain is going to overspread the area, so that by lunchtime, it'll be across western mass. Notice the further north and west you go, the drier it is, the further south and east, the more rainfall. I do think we'll probably end up with at least some light rain on Saturday into Saturday night with the heaviest rain off to the east. Also, the wind is starting to pick up out of the east-northeast as well, so that's going to keep us cool, damp, and just, uh, well, you need the jacket and the umbrella for Saturday. It is a coastal low. It's probably going to break up into two pieces. The first piece brings us that rain on Saturday. And then we catch, might catch a break late Saturday, Saturday night, which is kind of damp and cool. And then maybe another round of at least some light rain on Sunday or rain of varying rates of intensity. So that's the deal. Saturday, we're going to have that breeze out of the east. That's going to keep temps in the 50s to near 60 for most of southern New England. And that's more or less going to be the case on Sunday as well. Finally, that system will break down and move away, and we'll see slow improvement on Monday. Today, fantastic. Sunny, dry, a light breeze. Temperatures coming up into the low to mid-70s in the valley, near 70 in the hill towns. Then tonight, mainly clear and cool again, 40 to 45. Maybe just some thin clouds uh, by tomorrow morning. Make for a nice sunrise. And then just thin clouds tomorrow in the morning. Clouds may thicken up a bit in the afternoon. It might keep us a degree or two cooler, but still a nice day. The wind is light. Then here comes the rain as we head into the weekend. Varying rates of intensity, probably both Saturday and Sunday, keeping us cool. Breeze out of the east and northeast, maybe gust to about 30 miles per hour. Then our slow breakdown of that pattern in the beginning part of next week. All right, the time is 6.15. Amanda and David, back to you. Dan, thank you. Hold one man's